Hello, world. Few people have shaped the space of electronic music like Steve Duda. His creativity and lateral thinking have undoubtedly shaped him into the prolific creator we know and love. I mean, take this for example. Uh, and we're going to give you three days to try to do this. And I think I did it in about two hours because I had some macro software that was called Quick Keys that would allow you to just automate keystrokes. That's exactly the kind of filthy talk this channel is all about. So let's take a look at a really simple technique he uses for ABing that you can add to your toolbox of tricks. Key so that I can toggle between the two mutes. So this is something I do all the time. Let's get started. The idea is simple. By mapping one key to two on-off buttons and disabling one of them, you can quickly toggle between the two with the single touch of a key. Let's take a look at a few examples of when this trick comes in really handy. Here, I have two versions of the same finished track. One I mastered myself, while the other I had professionally mastered. I can now play through different sections of the track and toggle between the two to hear the differences. We can also use the same technique on devices. Perhaps you're not sure whether one effect is more suited to a certain track than another. Simply apply the key mapping to both and AB between them. Sometimes it's even useful to close your eyes and toggle a few times until you lose track of which is which. That way, you can AB between them just using your ears and without any bias. Finally, let's look at mixing or mastering to a reference track. This time, simply deactivate the reference track and just key map the solo button. Now you can instantly compare the balance of your mix to the reference at any time while you're mixing and have it polished up in no time. Click.